Welcome to the carseatblog.com video review of the bubble bum. Today I have my handy helper fresh back from school and we're going to look at how it buckles in and belt fit. So first let's talk about uh, the lap belt holder, the lap belt positioner. We leave it left, leave the lap belt threaded through the red belt holder uh, all the time just because it's easier and it kind of holds the uh, bubble bum booster in position as I drive around. Now my assistant will buckle herself in and show the technique. First she buckles the belt Then she threads the lap belt through the belt guide. We found that to be easier than trying to thread the lap belt through the belt guide first, then buckling. Just uh, gives a little bit uh, less slack in the belt to thread through. It was a little bit confusing for her otherwise. So easier to buckle first, then thread. And that's the way it looks. Go ahead and pull your belt tight, please. Don't strangle yourself. <laughs> <laughs> and great belt fit over the lap, low, touching the thighs, good shoulder belt fit, there it is on her shoulder, and very small booster, so it's great portability, great for three across, as you can see there's plenty of space in our uh, 2011 Acura MDX for a middle seat and an outboard position. So it's going to be a great portable booster, great for three across situations. All right, go ahead and unbuckle. Great job. <laughs> 